In this video, I am going to review the top 5 best CPUs for GTX 1060. All of my recommended processors have all the basic features along with lots of options to choose from. I researched a number of CPUs and filtered out some of the best for a better experience of GTX 1060, including 3GB and 3GB. I leave the links to the discussed CPUs in the description, you can check them for more information and the latest prices. So, let's get started. At number first, it is AMD Ryzen 5 2600. The best and the most affordable CPU for GTX 1060 is Ryzen 5 2600. This is also a Ryzen 2nd Gen CPU and is even more powerful than the Ryzen 5 2400G. It's worth mentioning that the Ryzen 5 2600 comes with a base clock of 3.4 GHz and a boost of 3.9 GHz on high gaming. Surprisingly, you can overrate your processor to a maximum of 4.0 GHz, increasing the performance by two folds. The AMD Ryzen 5 2600 processor with Wraith Stealth Cool is an extremely powerful processor that has some great integrated graphics. AMD Ryzen 5 2600 belongs to the second generation processor lineage and is known for pitching an extraordinary calculation timings. It surpassed all of the mentioned products in the list because it is nothing but the use of a multi-threading concept that peaked the average working timing of a single core. It blesses you with 6 cores and 12 threads, which means now you can multitask without any freezes and lags. It is affordable and what you get provides you with more value for your dollar than any other choice on the list. It comes with an unlocked CPU multiplier standard, solid gaming performance, and an excellent CPU cooler standard. If you are looking for slim builds, this will fit right in, but it isn't the smallest, and it has a good warranty. At number 2, it is Intel Core i5-8400. The Intel Core i5-8400 desktop processor is one of the best values that you can get with top-rated performance in many applications and games. It comes bundled with a cooler, has 6 cores included, and is one of the better prices that I have seen. The model comes with 6 cores and 6 threads and somewhat performs averagely with the AMD 5 2600. This Intel processor is a great choice for the GTX 1060. It has a cache memory of 9 MB, which makes the storage and retrieval of data very fast. The cooling system is also efficient and keeps the processor from overheating. In terms of clock speeds, the i5-8400 comes in at a 2.8 GHz base with a turbo up to 4 GHz. Comparatively, the R5-2600 has a base boost clock of 3.4 to 3.9 GHz. However, the R5-2600 can overclock to a comfortable 4.1 to 4.2 GHz without issue, whereas the i5-8400 is locked, meaning you can't overclock the CPU. The processor does not support any hyper-threading, which means your system might lag and freeze while multitasking. It's worth mentioning that the processor has more to offer when I keep aside the locked multiplier. You get a decent TDP and cooling solution on the processor, which makes the Intel Core i5-8400 worth it. This processor is a great option for anyone looking for a heavy-duty processor. It is pretty easy to install, so that is why it can be used by absolutely anyone. The price point is also affordable, you can check the link in the description below. At number 3, it is Intel Pentium Gold G5400. Intel Pentium G54V Gold Edition is an 8th generation Pentium processor with 2 cores and 4 threads, which is similar to the i3-7100. Belonging to the Golden Lineage, this processor can prove its worth to gamers and can be the best KPU for GTX 1060. Consisting of gold plating at the edges, this processor gives aesthetic vibes and operates efficiently, enabling users to use their GTX 1060 to the fullest. This chip is equipped with a base clock of 3.7 GHz, but doesn't have any boost clock, but again, 3.7 GHz is enough for handling any game and the GPU itself. It's surprising to see Pentium Gold G5400 competing against i3-7100. That's quite fascinating, in my opinion. From the recently recorded data, it can be easily inferred that the processor could generate a considerable number of FPS on games like Metal Gear and Final Fantasy XV. The best thing is that it is the cheapest Intel processor right now which won't bottleneck GTX 1060, except in a few cases where the game requires too much CPU power. If you are looking to hyperthread, this is one of the good CPUs for GTX 1060 that allows two cores to function. It has a bundled cooler that works pretty well. Overall, there is some good performance here. At number 4, it is Intel Core i3-8100. Intel Core i3-8100 has many features that allow it to stand out. It is the best budget processor for the GTX 1060, is the Intel Core i3-8100, which is a superb 4-core processor without any hyperthreading. The Intel Core i3-8100 comes with 4 cores, so it will give you good performance in both applications and in gaming. It comes at a nice low price and comes with a decent stock cooling system. 
One of the main reasons that I suggest i3-8100 CPU for the GTX 1060 graphics card is because you are able to get a high frame per second rate at 1080 Ultra, which is helpful in some situations. This CPU is equivalent to the i5s of the previous generations, which had 4 cores and 4 threads, but costed way more than this processor. So, this makes it a top choice for a mid-end card like GTX 1060, which will help you easily achieve more than 60 FPS at 1080p Ultra settings. It features a powerful base clock of 3.6 GHz with a cache memory of 6 MB, which makes it capable enough for handling any gaming-related task, and helps the GTX 1060 reach its potential to a great extent. Similar to the Pentium G5400, it too can be used with a simple H310 chipset motherboard to reduce the overall cost. And the last one is, AMD Ryzen 2400G. Ryzen 2400G is another great AMD processor for your GTX 1060. Although it has a greater base frequency than 2600, it still lacks cache, cores, and threads. Nonetheless, the processor comes with amazing features that enable you to play games at 4K without any issue. It was statistically proven that the processor overhauled the i3-8100. It was evident when the processor was checked against the i3-8100, and it turned out it's a greater chipset. The cores of this processor consist of a base clock speed of 3.6 GHz, but some of the cores can boost themselves to provide you a clock speed up to 4.0 GHz. The AMD Ryzen 5 2400G is a great chip with both CPU and GPU inbuilt, which doesn't require a dedicated graphics card for display and for playing casual games. However, it's better if you use it with a GPU like GTX 1060, which will provide you with a smooth gaming experience. The price tag for which this product comes is affordable and hence can prove to be the viable pick for the best KPU for GTX 1060. But this 5th AMD Ryzen 2400G, I have come to the end of my review. These all 5 are the best CPUs for GTX 1060 3GB and 6GB. Now it's up to you which will meet your budget and requirements. In my opinion, AMD Ryzen 5 2600 is the overall best CPU in terms of performance, playing games, and video editing. The links to discussed CPUs are in the description below. Thanks for watching this video.